for your flask. I wish it would give you just HP and mana back if you're full. How many runes they give? Um, I didn't look. We started that fight with 800 though, so there was like six of them there. That was about eight, uh, eight or that was about 1100 XP. Insane. What do I do when those are up? It seemed like we were doing pretty good damage, I guess. Um, I definitely want to like summon my Minotaur next time, a helper, and uh, you know, do something when those uh, golden things are there. Move out of the way. That might be. That might work. Hide behind something. Maybe I just, you know, kiss my ass goodbye again. We gotta do something. Let's go grab all those runes. Quite a bit of runes. Hey, boys. Make sure to grab him. Just make sure we grab everyone all at the same time, you know? See how much these guys give us. 184. Not bad. Were there being so many of them right here? The only thing that's annoying about them is they dodge or whatever. Like, if they didn't dodge, it would be a really good farm, but. their spears though I do should I get one myself and they drop these sunflowers wonder how much you can sell those for Almost at him. Price sells for ten. Yeah, arc works better against these guys. All right, let's go try this boss now. Sells for ten, so like you know they. If you kill like six of those guys and you get a, uh, well, no, probably like every 20 of those guys you kill, it's like killing an extra one of them because you get a hundred. Well, no, that's pretty slow. That's probably just doesn't even matter. A ring a ding. A ring a ding. Yeah, it probably helps you if you fight that guy in here. Thank you. Is it worth putting yourself up for a commission of emotes? Uh, yeah. If you enjoy making emotes. Um. 
through the tree. That one's a little rough. But like, you gotta price yourself right on Fiverr. You gotta price yourself to that like you can entice people to the, like come give you business and then you raise your rates or whatever. So I'm finally raising my rates and it's paying off a little bit more. But for a while there, I was making like twenty dollars an emote because I I wanted to get my, I wanted people to buy my my emotes over other people's right. So I get that reputation on Fiverr or get get those like five star reviews and such. Like, I'm still under where I want to be. I didn't even see that coming, man. Shoot. Okay, so it's when he puts his thing into the ground and he has the golden bubble. Did I not? What? I thought I... Mm. Oh yeah, we gotta do that one flash for the damage mitigation, right? You flashed early. There we go, there we go, there we go. It can get a little aggravating at times with certain customers though. Like, I got this guy right now who's like... It's just driving me nuts, bro. Like, I want to make sure I maintain that five star review rating, but I'm like, I already discounted this project anyways for him and his his revisions were like way off. Like what he what he was at, like his, his revisions are way off, bro. I'm like, dude, I already put like. <laughs> Like you already kind of okayed stuff, you know? I'm just like, well, fuck. Doing tattoos? Yeah, so like you kind of know how that is, you know? So it's like that, you know? It's like any other type of commission work that you probably are used to then. I'm, st I'm stuck again. Let's go north here and not jump off this time. And I would say the biggest thing about make uh, like doing emo commissions, it's 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 about speed. Cause like you can get very bogged down in it. And like, I got bogged down yesterday in making one, but uh, if you can do it with enough speed, it's definitely worthwhile. Cause like I charge, uh, like I want to be charging $35 in emote is my end goal, but I charge 25 right now and I can do a emote start to finish in under an hour. So, you know, at art rates, it's like 25 an hour. Um, But then like certain times, you know, you'll have an emote where you only got to adjust a couple things here or there. Like people who do like package deals, whatever. Like I definitely get like can fit two emotes into an hour if I know what, if I'm kind of batch working them.
my god, dude. If I get caught on one more thing in this god damn, bro. Shot. I draw more realism stuff, but so I'm not confident in cartoon things. Uh, I mean, there's a, I think there's a market for everything in every price point. Like, if you don't think people buy it, I would just drop your prices. Uh, on on Fiverr at least. Um, like, I mean, people do some like really weird stuff on Fiverr that I, when I was like really digging into it, uh, there's people who like have templates, right? And they just have templates built out, eye colors, hair colors hair types skin colors hand gestures and so they'll get an order from somebody and they'll charge like five bucks an emote but they're spending like five minutes on it like just putting like all right this person has brown hair with uh, green eyes and they want this and they they just like you know turn the layer on and off and they're charging like five bucks for that shit and you know that if you can do you know fucking if you can do like 10 of those real quick, like you're making a, you're making a little bit of coin right there. If you get, if you got the orders coming in like that, you know? You sad? We should get you sad emote. You sad? All right, we cannot let this person hit us, bro. This girl one shots. Is the save. Oh my god, I can't. S oh god. Get behind the tree! Yeah, she is fucking our dude up. I don't know if I can beat this lady, to be honest with you, man. skip this for a little bit that's a really tough fight will there be a fiber market for tattooed uh, designs oh definitely god dang it bro I forgot to go back to the one deal yeah there's a fight like fiber's kind of weird and interesting and you know I, I wish fiber was able to You saw it? Like there is a lot of bullshit on Fiverr, bro. And a lot of stuff who do people who do really bad work. Uh, but and it, it drowns out like the actual marketplace that's good on there. And it's it's aggravating, bro. Very aggravating. Cause like there's just people who are like just like shitlords on there put out terrible work and you know that's why it's like it's a meme but honestly like a platform that's a marketplace that's connecting people for this type of stuff is really nice let me go here dude what in the beetlejuice is that guy Same in every industry, scumbags doing it for cheap shit work. Yeah, right. Tattoo designs are different though. There are a lot of things that don't work for tattoos the average person doesn't know. Absolutely. I mean, yeah. That is a struggle, like commissioning across emotes. It's like 
people have their ideas of what they want versus what you know you can do. Oh my god. Like sometimes I, I get requests and like people ask me what I think about stuff and I'm like, like that sounds like a great idea, but you gotta remember like this thing is like 28 by 28, bro. Like, ooh, not a lot of readability there. Like, I'm trying to get one fiver off the ground, one of my gigs, which is like just editing TikTok gigs for people, bro. TikTok videos. <laughs> Cause like I'm a, I'm a pretty quick editor, uh, so it's it could be worth my while if I can get that off the ground. You should always get the artist who's gonna do your tattoo to design it. A hundred percent, man. Like I got people who ask me to design the tattoos in my real life, and I'm just like, just go to your like just go to your artist. You know? Like one, they'd rather do their own work anyways, and like two, they know exact like I've never done a tattoo in my life. So, like, I have ideas what cool tattoos look like, but, you know. What are these guys? If you're doing supreme quality, you, all, uh, you will achieve or return customers. Yes. I've had someone come back from me on Fiverr. Uh, who's come back three times already getting animated emotes and uh, not a lot of people can do animated emotes right now and so that's like a nice little market that's like I'm making I'm making a good bit of coin doing animated emotes for people and my animated emotes are like uh, for the most part or I do a lot of them like frame by frame rather than just like puppeteering in After Effects and uh, like I've had people come back to me time like so one girl uh, person's come back to me like three times. I showed off uh, it earlier. Let me go up uh, this one right here. Oh my God. Bro, I did not see this at all. I hate when I do that. Like this Pikachu I did it for this person. Like that person's come back to me like three times, man. Like I, I love that type of stuff. Cause like she trusts me. She's like, he, hey, this is what I want. And like, I don't even got to go through a revision process with her. Like I know what she likes. Uh, she knows what I can do. And it's like, I want this. I'm like, boom, boom, boom. I think it's awesome. Yeah, I'm a big fan of it. Thank you. Like, I, I like the way it turned out. I thought her idea was great. I think I uh, did. You know, I nailed it. I was like, oh, shit. Ow, fuck. What video we played that was uh, from someone on Fiverr. Yeah, I'm trying to get video editing stuff off the ground on Fiverr because uh, I like I like doing video editing a lot. Uh, I got the TikTok one up there, but I need to get an actual YouTube one up. But link. Animated emo, you say? Here's the best one. Oh, Gale Tunnel. Oh, this is the other side of the the one thing. Remember the locked door or whatever? Here it is. Dude, that guy's outfit is bad as fuck.
You mentioned having an app made for notifications. I look there. <laughs> yeah, people do that. You can get anything down Fiverr, bro. It's, 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 it's a great platform. I'm also going to try Upwork too. Here in a, a little, little bit. I got digging over that over the weekend. Dude, this place is awesome. has a sword I want I'm down I got took no fall damage get out of here oh god Work up on Twitter and I'm waiting uh, for you to get it. Oh, damn. Bro, how, how is that a good spell at all, dude? Flaming sword. I hope it's good. It's got yo a flaming sword has gotta be good enough to get me off an of axe. I'll tell you that right now. Or the whip. Cause this whip is amazing. I love this fucking whip, dude. And one shot this huge old dude. anything in and I'm dead fuck man I don't know why I go down tunnels like that you died fuck we did die we did die bro I love that you died emote <laughs> I'm loving it Punishment on my uh, things here. 
Damn. The cross? Naginata? Is that how you say that? Interesting. See what that's all about here in a second. Where's the thing at? Put it. Strength and dex for this. Oh, it's a spear. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh! I love these types of spears. Oh, that is lit. Oh, yeah. Is that better than the whip? Well, I guess I don't have the, uh, the the right stats for it, so I can't do it. L2 and R1 with it. That thing is nice, bro. Oh yeah, time to pre-roll some ads, baby. Top of the hour. We're gonna run some ads here. We don't, uh, you know, we gotta get deeper into this cave. And if uh, you wanna get deeper here into the channel, get yourself some emotes. You can drop that $5 a month here on the channel. You can also hit us with a free Twitch Prime. Well, we're going to go spelunking into this cave while you guys watch some ads. If you're not a subscriber here to this channel. And I'll be right back. What does this AC? Okay, buddy. Okay. You're not wrong, though. There we go. Uh, we have this outfit. This is what I was looking for if I wanted to uh, put this on. Still keeps us at medium low, but like, look, 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 at, the, look at the damage. We can withstand like twice the damage. And I, I like the idea that it's like kind of tight on us. Oh yeah, that's where we are. Outside the starting area on the Dragon Maw map. Growl Tunnel. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you the entrance here. Um, right here. This is where the entrance was to the Gale Tunnel. So in the east, right on the border, Gale Tunnel. Bro, we took out the astronomer. After three days, we finally got us a new chess piece. Tough. We don't gotta go down that cave anymore. 